You know, we have complained a lot about Kanye West. Hmm? Kanye West, uh, despite it's not from uh, the afro uh, culture, he's not from Nigeria, but he's a black guy, and uh, we love him and we care about him. So that's why most definitely we're going to talk about him. We complain too much about Kanye West, most especially the way he's treating his wife. Apparently, treating his wife, oh, according to the media, they are, they are already cooking up some really juicy story about Kanye West, that Kanye West is forcing his wife to wear some some outfit outside, treating her like a dog, treating her like an animal without uh, without say on, on on her own. She doesn't have freedom of speech and so on and so forth. Well, I don't know that the mainstream media. I don't know the agenda they are trying to build up. Maybe they are trying to use it against Kanye West in the future. But just in case they start using it against Kanye West in the future and he start having issue with his wife and his wife starts going around to say Kanye West was doing this to her, no freedom of speech, and the court will, will be trying to jail Kanye West for life, just the same tactics they use over, uh, over and over again, just know that I, Adam Slink, will not believe that shit. Just know that I, Adam Slink, will stand for Kanye West. Because she now, she moves freely. She can decide to say no. She has a mouth of, of her own. She can talk. She mingles with, with people. Well, of course, that outfit she wore recently was it something that uh, anyone, any man, a responsible man, I will like his woman to wear. We already know that, guys. The outfit uh, was so, so revealing. Like, wait till they are poor. Now, can you wear his wife be this old? But can you wear said he love it? Yes, so can you wear said he love it? Two people should get his wife's name off your mouth. Yo, I just want to tell everybody I posted my wife three times on purpose. You understand what I'm saying? What? what <laughs> <man>? <laughs> uh, no. So what I'm saying is, I delivered the album. Then people still in my comments talking about, why are you posting your wife? Because she make me happy. That's why y'all happy with the music, because I'm happy. You understand? So don't ever say nothing negative. If you don't like my page, and don't like what I'm posting, go fuck yourself. Seriously. Leave me, leave the king the fuck alone. I don't care, bro. I'm going to post my wife as much as I want. Go post your wife. When you say go and post your wife on your Instagram. If they post your wife, you know they complain. Go post your own wife on Instagram. Allow your wife to dress the way she wants and go post her. <laughs> And meanwhile, you know, when such people speak, yeah, and that same person is making so much success, it's really, really hard to judge such person. Kanye West made 19 point something million US dollars. That is approximately more than 20 billion naira for just one day. Just one day, yesterday, Kanye West made 19 million US dollars. From his, uh, from his, uh, his clothing uh, franchise. Closing franchise only, not the musical, just from that. He made 90 point something million US dollars. That's about 25 or 30, 20, 20 something billion naira. So, such person that you think is crazy, he has bipolar. He doesn't know what he's doing. And still coming up with some kind of uh, outfit that people love to make that kind of money. It's really hard to judge your person. Honestly, it's hard. It's hard. Because in our society today, huh? in our society today, you are not mad if you are making a living for yourself. You are not mad if you are rich, super, super rich. There are some lunatic, really, really mad people that are super, super rich. But because they are rich, we always carry them so high. A madman can never make sense. Go and ask. There is your uncle somewhere in, the, in that village. There is one madman somewhere in that village that always speaks the truth. But you will never listen because uh, how come you make so much sense and yet you are this poor? You know, a poor man... A madman doesn't make any sense. But if you are 
bad and rich. Now you are making a sense. You know, you is, hope you guys get it right. So Kanye West might be crazy like you think, but he's making money. And as long as he's making money, money rules the world. Money rules the world. Nothing else. We, go, we don't want to listen to any other language that doesn't have to do with money. Money, 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 money is what we want to hear. And as long as you are making it, you are a wise man. Yeah, you are a genius. You are a wise man. And God has surely blessed you. Yeah, that is just how the world works. It's quite unfortunate, but that is just how it works. No, nobody, I'm, I'm not about to change it. In fact, I'm not even planning. I'm not even telling you. Kanye West is a genius, he's a wise man. That's what you guys believe now. Huh? Huh? Then again, you guys complain about Bianca, right? Kanye West's wife. Then, what about a Beyonce? Beyonce released uh, uh, pictures for her new music, and uh, that is what she was wearing. Hmm? If Jay Z can allow Beyonce to dress like that, so why are you all up on uh, Kanye West's business? Hmm? Let's see. Let's see think about that also. Huh? Let's think about that also. Guys making money, and money rules the world. He's making money, and money rules the world. So whatever Kanye West will say, as long as he's going to back it up with releasing an album, releasing some outfits that people are going to love, it's making sense. In fact, this guy can decide, eh? this guy can decide to use a paper bag or nylon bag to make a t-shirt and it's still going to sell. People will still buy it. A nylon bag to make a t-shirt and you will still buy it after all there are tall jeans now jeans that are tall they're tall jeans a jean that is well made they will end up designing it by tearing it and meanwhile during those days i will see someone wearing tall jeans we start looking at that person as a ruffian but as soon as the rich started wearing tall jeans we started accepting it we started like yeah yeah this thing is nice this thing is good the rich started wearing it so we need the rich to validate all those immoralities if the rich validate all those immoralities the world will follow because the world the majority of human beings follow the rich they look up to the rich mm? so that being said mm? i want to also kind of like trace this matter down to our musicians hmm? you see Kanye West making so much money from musical not music not music for from music then trace it down to our Nigeria celebrities who are busy beefing each other who are busy fighting each other of course you know Bonobo and David are fighting each other now and we have a whiskey there as the rest huh? busy fighting each other and yet again eh, for example Kanye West if you check, see what Kanye West did for his community, for people, then you will understand the power he has. Always giving back to the community, giving back to the people. He has his own university. Yeah, he has his own university, Kanye West. And again, guys, this is it. Originally, Kanye West promised that all his outfit that is going to release that day will be twenty dollar benchmark all of them and he gave them up for twenty dollar benchmark previously it was two hundred dollar people who bought those outfits for two hundred dollar you know what he's doing is refunding them one hundred eighty dollar if you bought that outfit two hundred dollar it will refund you one hundred eighty dollar I to tell you how much is giving back to the community. Then, when you go back for our musician, as long as none of our musicians eh, are giving out to the public, eh, they are not putting a substantial thing on the ground for legacy purposes, then I don't think we should even hype our musician that high. That means somebody trying to kill himself over whiskey, over Davido, over Bonaboy. 
then the question should be what have those people done for you in fact eh, i'm going to make a whole video about this i i should have attached it here i'm going to make a whole video about this today asking you guys the question what has whiskey davido and bonaboy done for you like what project have they uh, back to give back to the community it's not only the government the government is the government that the government the government 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 government, government. the government cannot do it all in every society the government cannot do it all they can't with so much with this kind of population the government can't do it all it takes a whole country to be able to uplift themselves huh? so that being said uh it's a boy again adam slink like i've said before i'm going to do a whole video about that so don't worry stay tuned catch you next time peace